in New York City, it feels cold outside. Actually, early this morning, so I could do my planner, send out some emails, and just kind of get ahead of the day. It's, it's kind of an elite feeling waking up early. Like when I do it, I'm like, I'm proud of myself. Anywho, today we are going to the Aloe Gym, the Influencer Gym, whatever you wanna call it. I went to the Aloe Gym like a year or two ago with some of my friends and it was really fun. Um, and now they offer Pilates, so I'm going to take a Pilates lesson by Astrid. She's one of the Aloe instructors and it's it's really cool and it's really fun because they will send you um, or they'll give you when you get there an Aloe set to wear while you do the workout and you obviously like film the workout and stuff like that so you have to be willing to do that. But I'm really excited. You guys know I've been in my Pilates era so I'm pumped. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I think it's just me and the instructor today. Um, but I gotta like have my form right. Um, but it's kind of nice, I don't have to get dressed up. Like I don't have to put on a workout outfit. I'll probably just, I mean, I could just go in my pajamas because she's giving me a workout set there. She sent me a, two pictures of two different sets. Um, so I think it's cool. It's great marketing on their part. So I'm excited about that. ASMR. Okay, yeah, so I literally just kept the sweatshirt on. I put on a headband to make it a little cuter. I've got my thermal lined leggings on, even though I'm gonna change when I get there. These nude stick slip bombs are very nice. Pilates socks, sneakers. I'm gonna throw on a jacket. Maybe I should get a hair tie just to be safe. Hair tie acquired. Obviously gonna put on a coat. I'm definitely nervous. Like I'm definitely nervous, but you know what? We're gonna have fun. And she invited me in, so it's chill. Chill. Let's go. Okay, we have two different outfits to go with. The bathroom is so cute. It's all stocked up. I'm gonna go with this one. A matching sweatshirt too. taken a Pilates class or a reformer Pilates class where you have a mirror because at New York Pilates it's I like it it's very chill relaxing there's no pressure there's no mirrors but it was nice to have a mirror at the Allo gym because I could see my form and I was like constantly correcting she'd be like good fix good fix I really enjoyed that it was me and one other girl Deb she was so nice and I felt really comfortable there I was kind of nervous I was just gonna feel really intimidated but it really wasn't like that and Astrid was so nice and she really hooked it up. I'm so excited because I have another set in this color from Aloe as well. If you guys remember, I wear it all the time. It's like the high neck one. Um, so now I can wear the sweatshirt with the set I wore today and then the other one too. So of course had to get my OPP because I've been in Florida, um, I mean just for a weekend, but I was craving my smoothie. <laughs> so we're gonna shower and we're gonna get ready for the day because we have lots of fun things we're doing. I put in my clip-in hair extensions today because I think I'm going to wear them to the event I'm going to tonight. I just love them so much. They're from Luxie Hair. They're the seamless clip-in hair extensions, and they're so good. I think I still have a code for them, Danielle Carolyn, for 10% off. I also did, like, light makeup. I just did a TikTok of, like, trying a ton of different products. So go follow me on TikTok, at Danielle underscore Carolyn. It was a good time. Anywho, I'm just turning on the mic. Little gals on the go. We need to figure out a way to like bring these to the studio because I love how it says gals on the go on it. Um, I'm gonna record some ads and then I have a call at 1 p.m. with somebody who's helping me with creative, like with graphic design 
um, for this new project that I'm launching really, really soon or a new series that I keep talking about. So I'm excited about that. She sent me the first round of designs. We're going to like talk about it today. Um, and then I'm going to edit. I like filmed a little video this morning um, for short form too of like going to the aloe gym and kind of my experience. So I want to edit that. And then I want to respond to all my emails and I need to eat more food. I am getting hungry and all I have in here is breakfast food. So I'm not opposed to having eggs and turkey sausage for lunch. I'm not opposed. Let's do this. This show is sponsored by Better Help. Where are you already crushing it? Think opposite of new year, new year. Ads are done. Pop de la Croix. I need to put on my blue light glasses. My head's starting to hurt a little bit. <laughs> I have four minutes until this call. So I'm gonna edit this TikTok. Sometimes I edit the TikToks on my phone. I use the app InShot. I really like it. Um, but then other times I like to edit on my computer. And right now I'm kind of feeling like editing on my computer. Cause I just don't like, you know, when you're on your phone editing, whereas the computer, you have it all widespread out there. After this call, I'm going to eat. After this call, we're gonna have lunch. <laughs> the call went so well. I just love working with creative people. It's just so interesting how their mind works. And I'm like, okay, I don't know if this could happen, but you, can we do this instead? And she's like, oh yes, we can do that. It'll just give off more of this vibe. And I'm like, wow, your brain is, I just, I love working with creative minds. Okay, let's make some food. <laughs> Also, I feel like everyone around me is getting sick right now and I just I just don't have time for that I'm staying healthy because I've started taking Armra colostrum I saw so much about it online and I was like, okay, I have to try this. This is the good stuff right here This is Armra colostrum right now I've just been taking one scoop because Armra colostrum is a bioactive whole food You can take as many scoops as you want a day You can take one two three whatever feels best for you You could literally just put it right in your mouth Which I've done before or you can put it in a beverage you could put it in like your yogurt bowl I want to try and put it in a smoothie because you guys know I love making my chocolate protein smoothies now So Armra colostrum is a bioactive bioactive whole food incredible for the gut i've seen less bloating i just feel amazing i feel like my insides are just screaming happiness which i feel like is usually rare during this time of year but i've just been feeling great and really the only difference in my routine is that i've been taking the armor colostrum a lot of you guys have been telling me as well that my skin is looking really radiant again Armra colostrum. You guys know how much I love my beverages, so this is an easy add to my routine. This is like a viral bioactive whole food. Like everyone's talking about it right now. My friends and I have been texting it. Every time someone comes over to my apartment, <laughs> my spray tan lady was here the other day and she saw my Armra colostrum on my shelf and she was like, is that good? So if you're wondering what colostrum is, I totally understand where your confusion might be coming from. So basically it is a dairy bioactive whole food produced by all mammals within the first 48 to 72 hours of giving birth. So it's that like first nutrition that we receive and it has all those essential nutrients that you need. Like this sounds incredible. This seems elite. So this is supporting your cells, your gut, your immune system, and so much more. That's why like you might start seeing new hair growth with your baby hairs. You might see more radiant skin. Like it's just all of this amazingness. I'm like, yep, sign me up. I am taking Armra colostrum. There are over 400 bioactive nutrients in this guy right here. This is activating your body stem cell production. So we're talking collagen. We're talking skin elasticity. It strengthens your gut wall barrier which I feel like is a thing that a lot of people are trying to do right now. I just love that in 2024, we can have something like this in a little beverage, or like I said, a little dry scoop in the mouth, whatever you want. I'm so obsessed that I even have the mini travel ones. So when I'm on the go, cause we have a ton of live shows coming up and your girl is staying healthy. I totally hear you guys on like, oh my gosh, I don't know which products to get, which ones to infuse in my routine, but this one is definitely worth it. And I have a code for you guys. So you can try it for 15% off. Click that link down below and use the code Danielle Carolyn. You'll get 15% off your first order. I'll have it here on the screen as well. So I'm gonna sip on this while I make some lunch, but we're gonna actually make breakfast because that's all I have in my fridge. All I have are beverages and breakfast food. You know, that's just how we roll here. So I'm gonna do some scrambled eggs with some chicken and sage breakfast sausage. That just sounds good, right? Call brunch. 
years. So as I keep mentioning, Fashion Week is next week and last season I really leaned into it and had so much fun creating looks and loved seeing y'all's reactions to my fits. And we're gonna do the same thing this February Fashion Week. I'm so excited. My friend Cassidy is helping me style. I was like, I want like three solid outfits. Her and I have very similar style and I kind of sent her a mood board with some looks. Um, and she and I picked out a lot of looks <laughs> and we're gonna try them all on and decide which ones we're keeping, like what my top three are. Not everything came today. There's like a few pieces coming tomorrow, but her and I are both literally so busy. It was like this, let's just try on everything we can for now since Fashion Week's next week. And then next week we're gonna do a final like style fitting, like styling session, I guess. So I had to pull out my little Amazon um, portable clothing rack. So I think that'll be fun. I'm pulling that out. I have all the boxes in my hallway. And she told me to just wait to open the boxes till she gets here. She's a stylist at Moda Operandi and she's amazing. Um, so I'm so excited. Like these looks are sick. So I can't wait to finally try them on. Um, so yeah, this is from Amazon. It's like $30. It's not the most sturdy one in the world, but if you, for moments like this, when you're planning outfits for a trip or something, it's definitely ideal. And I'm gonna grab some clothing hangers, actually. Cassidy is here! <laughs> and there's so many fun things happening. No, we're so excited. Oh, this top, I'm so excited to try no, it No, I am, that's my favorite, I think. It's so it's sick. It's gonna be really cute. Awake oh, mode. Yeah. Um, so we have red lots red of red. fun things. Yes, there's a really fun red moment. So we'll show you guys some of the looks as I try them on. We did this when I went to Greece and it was really fun. <laughs> um, so we're doing it again, baby. Okay, I haven't looked yet. We just tried on the, the, the fit. So. It's really cool. <gasps> oh, mama! <laughs> right? Isn't it so oh, cool? Oh my it's gosh. It's really chic and like cool and different. This, oh, it, it's like sex. weirdly hot. Yeah. Like, no, it's, it's like so, so conservative, like, yeah, but, <laughs> but like it's so like flattering and beautiful. I'm obsessed with that. It's definitely like very elevated. It's so yeah, elevated. Yeah, it's really cool. I'm you crushed this. Wait, I love it. This is I'm so, so happy. I love when this happens. I know. <laughs> I know. It's like a good first <laughs> one. When the comes to yes. life, I'm like, I love it. Wow. Wow. Oh, Amazing. This is a little Stella McCartney moment. Yeah, it's really TWP. cool. TWP. Okay, let me take an actual picture. For oh yeah, and then she takes a photo so that. Fitting tech. We have to refer, and I always have to smile. Yeah. <laughs> you always have to smile. Okay, I'm literally obsessed. No, like, this is it's like so done. Cool. The, I don't know how what you just did to like <laughs> cinch every, but she does such a good job of like, like she literally dresses me. It's so nice. <laughs> no, it's so cute. I also like obviously I love it like this, but I want, I'm curious to see what it looks like without the shirt too. Oh, this will be worn again, <laughs> but a price. I'm like, look oh! at that. wow, it's like so sexy and pretty. I. Love an yeah, hourglass. and everything. I know. Too. Like, wow, that wow. is great. You would think it's tailored to me. No, it literally fits you perfectly. <laughs> and another thing, Ooh. like, once obviously you decide that you're like keeping it in, then stuff, you cut the threads. We can cut all the threads like down there and stuff too. I was like, wondering why I was walking funny. Yeah, you're like, this is hard. No, we would cut that, and then there would be like, it would definitely be more like sexy leg. leg moment. So but, like, I'm being drama, and I keep not looking. <laughs> I love okay, it. do we like it? No, it's. Are perfect. Well, first of all, obviously they definitely need to be hemmed. A yeah, I, I knew. So that I'm would glad be a that you know, probably just an inch or two, just so that it still hits the shoe nicely. Yeah. Oh but my like toes. the waist is perfect. They yeah. hit at the perfect spot. I like. I'm into this where it's right under the belly. And button. you know what I'm thinking? Maybe let's grab a belt and like Ooh, do a belt. Ooh, a little moment. Okay, I have. Yeah. Okay, so this is gold. So and like, yeah, do? like this is yeah, sick. Like, so cool. Guys, this is so cute. Cass is so good. Everyone go follow Cass. Cass Adula on Instagram. I love. She's going to grab a belt. Do you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, hey, hey. Okay. I'm glad I kept my I hair grab two. Okay. Obviously, I don't think it needs it, but I think it adds like a little something. It does add a little something. Which is cool. I don't hate it. I like it. I like it without the belt and I like it with the belt. So I yeah. guess we could decide Let's day of. Let's take a picture of both. Okay. We take a picture. 
so cute. So we're trying on this top. The pants haven't come in yet, so don't look at my pants. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's not. Um, pants. But this top is so sick. This is more of like a night out vibe, um, with some like black leather pants, kind of low rise. You'll see. So I tied it a little bit lower. And I just feel like that's better. Oh, like okay. It a little bit higher. Okay, like yeah. More, I feel like lower gives you even more of like the back vibe, Zhush. which we like. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I love Super it. Super cute. It's so fun having my long hair trying yeah. all this on and makeup on. It, it really makes a difference. <laughs> no, it does. You look perfect. I'm ready to go. Okay, okay. <laughs> bye guys. Good night. It'd be so Oh my gosh. Cute. I love the red. I love this. This is so cute and so flattering. The only thing I'm not sure about is the boots with this. I know. I think it might be a little too cowgirl. -esque. Yeah. I love this top. It like cinches it's really in. Really cute. And I love me some red. Yeah. Oh, you're able to button it. Yeah. Really cute. Okay, let's try a different shoe with it. I mean, I don't know what. I think those Paris Texas would be cute, but let me just look. Yeah, go. Go let's look. look so I do like boots like tall boots with like a short skirt is there a world maybe i'd like it better if i was wearing tights like i don't know but is that too much black and red no, <laughs> my legs all oiled up yeah so we switched it out for this these top is silver great pumps. yeah i i can wear this top when i podcast it's yeah. a nice bright color yeah it's really cute we just i'm uh, like so i could you know i yeah. wear this with that and then all the time. Wait, whatever. Okay, this is really cute oh, yeah let's take a pic okay. Shoes. Yeah, I get the shoes. So cute. I just yeah. love the red too because red's like yeah, this the this, color of the season. I feel like this is one of those that people be like love. Yes, it. like, like love it's so pretty because it's like stand out. It's so stand out, and yes. I love the reds together. Yeah, me too. I love monochromatic right now. Same. <laughs> okay, I'm nervous. No. I'm really nervous. <laughs> don't be nervous at all. Oh, <laughs> that's why I was like, don't be nervous. It looks. Sick. Guys, I get so nervous for a mini skirt. Like this is this skirt is Kate. It's literally the moment. It's That's why sickening. this is Kate because she knows what to do. Yes. Or is it a she? No. Yeah. It's okay. sick. No, I'm obsessed with this. It's so so beautiful. This is really cool. I'm like the green. A little Prada tank. No, we love a Prada tank. I I'm love obsessed. this. Yeah, it's really good. I'm like, I this is the perfect, this. I've been looking for the perfect black like skirt. Black mini skirt. And yeah. I actually like how it doesn't have a slit. No, and it, it hits you perfectly. And the good thing about this is that it's real leather, so it's like good quality. It's so gonna it's going to like hold and yeah. stack. We, you know, are, we are in, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> you are locked and loaded. Oh, I love it. No, the, it's really if cute. If I'm cold, I can do this, but yeah. then you can't see the whole outfit. <laughs> no, the, the whole outfit. You're like, You're like the whole outfit's gone. That stresses yeah. me out. No, this is really and cute. And even, like, again, literally see you later. Uh, need a cool event to win this. <laughs> I know. This is so cool. No, I'm like, wait, should you wear this to the... Oh, true. Well, you know the vibes. I know. I need to, like, decide. Yeah, you'll let me know. Okay, wait. Let's just take it. Danielle, just imagine like the photos in this. No, this I know. Sick. I know. Is, I really like this yes. a lot. It's really, really cool. And I actually love that this is looser and like kind of yeah. hits you in a place like that. This wow, is this so is cute. really cool. It's like chic first lady vibes. Yeah. <laughs> but like trendy first lady. Yeah. Like this is no, so I beautiful. It. That's really cool. I love a and winter the white. The great too. I think we could try it on with the black boots too. What bag, what color bag would you I do? I think again, silver. You would do like the Yeah, silver. I know I'm in silver right now. Like we're I all guess not if you don't, if you. Oh, the boots do look cute. You know what I'm saying? Oh my I God, it's like this. Cool. And I would like wear this top on its own. Yes. Totally, show. with like jeans. Yeah. yeah. And you could wear the skirt on your own too, with like a sweater. Oh, yes. Like tucked in, I'm like so cute. I like how there's a slit in the back. Totally. It's really flattering. Yeah, this is, this is nice. Yeah. No, I love that. It's really cute. I like a lot. <laughs> I mean. Oh! 10 out of 10! I can't believe the stretch, like it's so flattering. No, it's so flattering and stretchy, and again, Besides Fashion Week with like a blazer, cute vibes, whatever. Oh, like, can you grab a blazer? Any, yeah, I just it's, it's, it's over on the chair oh, over yeah. there. This is so stunning. This is 16 Arlington, I believe. Yeah, it's beautiful. Got the black heels on. I love the color. I know wow. we were debating not liking it. Yeah, first, I just think I would like I the color. I really do like it. I feel like so some wear this outfit. Yes. <laughs> we no, it's so cute. Oh, I actually I'm love with it with the blazer yeah. too. No, it's so cute. And it's like a little sparkly fun, but like so cute. 
Gosh, Cassie, oh, you really did a good job. <laughs> like, Yay. this is so stunning. I know it's really pretty. I'm obsessed with ah! this. Yay. I'm obsessed. Cass just left. I'm so obsessed with all of the looks. So that's gonna be a problem because I wasn't I'm not gonna keep all of them. I wanna FaceTime Ryan though and see if he notices my hair is longer. In a meeting. Took all my makeup off. I'm currently doing a Manuka honey face mask. It's very moisturizing, very antibacterial. So we're doing that right now. Cleaning up around here. Um, I've almost finished my to-do list for today. It's ended up being a little bit more productive than I thought it would be because we were supposed to record a podcast today. We are supposed to go on someone else's podcast today and they had to cancel. So I'm not, I'm, I can't wait to reschedule because it's a really fun podcast, but I'm also like not mad when I got a couple more hours to myself to get stuff done. Okay, touched up my hair. I cannot believe how, I just need to be wearing these clip-ins more. Like I'm obsessed. Oh, I didn't even tell you guys what the heck I'm doing. You're like, why are you all dressed up? <laughs> I am going to an event at the Whitney Museum of Art. It's sponsored by Cynthia Rally, So she's um, invited some of us and dressing some of us for the event. I'm so excited. MGMT is performing. If you if you look them up, you know some of their songs. Like one of their songs is called Kids, where it's like, da, 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 da. Such a good song. I feel like this is a very Gossip Girl event and I'm very excited. So going to Soho House beforehand with uh, Katie, Cass, and then Brooks meeting us a little bit after and we'll go to the event together. So this dress is from Cynthia Raleigh. I went and got it. You guys saw in the vlog. Yeah, I tried it on last week and I went with this one. I love it. I'm borrowing this bag from Forward right now. It's so stunning. It's a YSL bag, but I really like it because there's no specific hardware. You can wear gold or silver with it. Earrings are anthropology. Um, bracelets are love AJ. I can't decide if I should just not wear them. And then wearing just some sheer black tights, black Arezzo heels that are always linked to my LTK. And we are packing the bag. So we're gonna bring some lipstick, lip gloss, some lip balm, tampon, wallet. Do I need anything else? I think that's all I really need. And the way this bag closes is like the L of the YSL. And then as for jacket, I think I'm going to just wear my oversized, sorry, this is like slanted. My oversized black Frankie Shop blazer. I'm trying to show you guys the fit. But I'm happy with it. Let's go. Oh, a little warm towel upon arrival. Thank you. Love this. <laughs> back now and I'm just about to make some sleepy time tea just to kind of wind down from the night. I am obsessed with this guy on TikTok, you guys. I'm literally watching this guy at Disney right now. His Insta, I talked about him on the podcast, at Jarendell. I'm not even the biggest Disney person, but he has the best energy. And like, he just, well, just, he got so excited because Jasmine okay, rode with him on the magic carpet ride and like He's just the happiest guy And so I've just been like playing his TikToks while I've been cleaning my kitchen So shout out him. It's really making me want to go back to Disney Because Ryan and I had the best time when we went But tonight's event was so lovely. Everyone was dressed to the nines like people were actually dancing Which is always really fun when people actually dance um, and I came home, I scrubbed off what's left of my spray tan because we're getting another one tomorrow because we have more live shows. This weekend we're going to Charlotte. These are my current favorite pajamas. They're the Skims I got them for Christmas. And that's that on that. I really want to get back into reading because I was on my grind reading when I was in Mexico 
And then I just started this new book, The Wife Between Us, but I'm always so tired when I get into bed, so I literally read two pages. So I want to actually get into bed and read and enjoy it. So I'm going to wait for my tea, brush my teeth, and I'll see you guys in the morning. not read I got in bed and I actually just fell right asleep so, well I was on my phone for 10 minutes max um anyways drinking my coffee I put a face mask in the fridge which was such a move because it kind of woke me up I'm gonna hop in the shower we're gonna get ready because we're going to the meta office this morning I'm really excited I believe Eva Chen's gonna be there it's a meta um Instagram fashion event like breakfast fireside chat just getting to know the team i can ask any questions i have and i'm really excited brooke's going to um so i'm like stressed though i'm meeting eva chen i'm like what do i wear so but i want to be comfortable but i'm really excited it's like a few hours long and it starts at 9 a.m so i'm like up and at them so let's get in the shower let's get ready but i'm excited <laughs> We Dyson Airwrapped our hair today. I haven't pulled for my Dyson Airwrap like the curling feature with my shorter hair, but I'm realizing I keep thinking my hair is super short, but it is growing. So I was like, let me give it a go. And I did it. And I really like how it made my front pieces look, how it actually keeps my front pieces out of my face. Um, I'll show you guys my fit. I'm wearing this top. It's so nice. It like is like an hourglass top from Orson Dyrus. And I don't know if I should like button it all the way right now. I kind of have it open. And then I'm wearing these black Abercrombie jeans. They're just like, I think they're like Abercrombie dad jeans or something. Below the belt. Belt earrings are Love AJ probably. Boots, I can't remember. They're just like some black boots. And we're gonna do the same bag that I did last night. And then I'm renting this Tory Burch coat from Pickle. You guys know how much I love Pickle. That's the fit. This coat is a little bit more orangey looking in person. So a warm tone outfit underneath would probably have been better, but this was the plan and I don't really have time to change. So hopefully this is good. Um, I'm excited. I've, I'm excited to learn and just soak it all up. It's times like this I'm really grateful for what I do to get to go to the meta office. I've been once before, um, but this will be really cool to take almost as like a masterclass or something. And um, like, I feel like we'll talk about Instagram reels and threads and ever stories, everything like that. And I hope I get to meet Eva Jen. That'd be really cool. Okay, let's go. I'll take you guys with me. Good shot, I'm working out this morning. Outskirts of town. Playing Taylor Swift. We're eating breakfast. It feels so. I love this. This is so fun. Corporate morning. Corporate morning. <laughs> One thing about me: as soon as I know I am not going out anymore, doing anything where it's being photographed, I am taking off my makeup. Like I hate feeling makeup on my skin. I feel like I can relax more. Everything. Um, so I just washed my face, even though I was like, my makeup's still so fresh, but I'm going to get my nails done. Like we don't need to have my makeup done for that. Um, saying goodbye to my bronze brown nails because we've got gals in the go live shows and we have fashion week. So I'm doing like a, this is the inspo I sent. I wanted like that milky pink nail. I think I'm not doing chrome, which is crazy because I pretty much 
always get chrome unless I do red. I usually won't do chrome then. So this was my inspo, just kind of like a milky pink, if that makes any sort of sense. It just looks luscious, like you just wanna jump into it. So I'm not going to Mickey because she's not feeling well. Um, so I'm going somewhere else and I'm a little nervous because I like always go to her. Um, and she was like, oh, come in. I was like, absolutely not. Please stay home and rest. Um, so though, we're gonna go somewhere else. I'm also gonna get a pedicure, which if you know, you know, getting a pedicure and a manicure at the same time, it's cool. Cause you're like, oh my gosh, so much is happening, but it's also like, you can't really relax. So this is more for efficiency. Cause we have some calls. Um, I'm in no means complaining. I'm just saying like, if you know, you know, like I try to get like a pedicure on my own, on its own. Cause it's so relaxing, but I really need both now because we have live shows, we have things. I might not even be showing my toes. I'm not sure, but for fashion week next, it just needs to happen. So. I changed back into my tried and true little comfy set. These pants are from Windsor. They're from Julia Haven's collection and they need to restock them because they're so great. And then the bar sweatshirt and then I just throw on some Uggs because I get a gel pedicure and it lasts for months, literally months. Maybe I'll put some hoop earrings in just to look a little better. Nails are done. I'm waiting for my therapist to hop on. I have therapy right now and I'm so excited. So much to chat about with my girl. These are the nails. I'm really happy. I did the same on my toes. And I just made a little cup of coffee. And we're gonna get started. Today was a doozy. I feel like all these tissues from my tears. I swear I'll think I'm fine and then my therapist says one thing and I'm like, oh my God. So it's nice, it feels good to cry. Um, being in your 20s is weird. <laughs> That's all. All is well. I just feel like I have lots of emotions recently. So, yeah, I have two more calls about some things. We have a team call for Gals on the Go because we leave for Charlotte tomorrow. I need to pack, spray tan. And Ryan's going to come over later. And I think we're going to cook together, which will be fun. I like cooking together. It's more fun when you're, because when you cook alone, it's just kind of like, which I know people romanticize it and I do every now and then, but it is fun to cook with somebody. Anyways, I'll just bring the mood down. We are good. We are good. Okay, so for Valentine's Day, I never get Ryan like anything crate. Like our anniversary is also a month after and we usually, I don't know, like give, like Christmas just, I don't know. Usually we just do something cute. Like he gets me flowers and like a little thing and I, I don't even know what I've gotten him in the past. Just like little things. Anyways. Um, Abby from Abode reached out to me and was like, hey, we're doing this thing where um, they do like a ton of really cool embroidery. I'm gonna show you guys the TikTok. Like I'm gonna t kiss something and write a little handwritten note and they're gonna embroider it on a pair of boxers. <laughs> How awesome. So she wants me to, cause you can order it yourself. So you guys can totally do this too. I'm gonna put on some really dark lipstick right now and Kiss a piece of paper. Thank God I have post-it notes. And then um, I guess I'll write something as well. And then I'll take a picture of it and they'll they'll print out the photo and they'll embroider it on a pair of boxers. And I feel like that's perfect for Valentine's Day. That's like cheeky, cute. So let's do it. This is Natasha Denona Berry Pop. I guess it doesn't need to be her hair. Feels so weird just like raw dog and red, loves red lipstick. Like usually do liner and everything. <laughs> And now I'm just going to kiss this. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Is this like weird to put on the internet? Is this intimate? I don't know. Okay, so there's one item. And then I'm trying to think of something we say to each other that would be cute to write. Okay, I know what I'm gonna say and you guys can't know actually. Is he just gonna kill me? So we call, I'm gonna write love you Bubba. Cause we, he's gonna kill me. We've recently, it was like a joke and now we say it kind of seriously. It's like, hey, Bubbaloo. Like, like it came from Bubba and then it was like Bubbaloo. And it's like a joke, but it's not like, it's just funny. But I think Bubbaloo is a bit too much. So I'm gonna write, love you, Bubba. I think it's fun to say Bubba. <laughs> fun fact about me. I mean, a lot of people and they're like, you look like the kind of girl that would have really cute handwriting. And I'm like, no, I don't. Also, I know my lips are just, so we have this and we have this. <laughs> I'm gonna take pictures of it and then I'll go pick it up from a boat. It's so nice of her. 
I think that's such a cute idea. So you guys can do it too. And it looks like they have like underwear and other things, not just boxers. Give it a go. I need to wash this off before my call. Hi guys, I just got a spray tan. So I'm in my spray tan PJs, my skims. I'm eating a Think Bar. I love these so much. This is the chocolate like brownie flavor because Ryan's not coming for another hour with the ingredients because, because, because he has work and I need to pack. I need to pack right now because I want to be able to be present with him when he gets here. Um, and we're making pizzas. We're gonna make pizzas and watch SNL. I'm so excited. Like that just sounds like an ideal evening. So I am excited because it's gonna be a really simple packing situation. Like I could carry on, I could, but I don't, with my credit card with Delta, I get two free checked bags. So I typically just check. So, but I might just pack, I don't know, whatever. So I, of course I'm crazy and I have this little, um. Google Drive, because I make this for like everything with outfits for trips and stuff, as you guys know. So since we have three shows coming up, um, if you're watching this, I think you can still buy tickets to Toronto and um, Philly. So link down below, galsinthegopodcast.com. It's gonna be a good time. Here is what I'm wearing to the Charlotte show. I'm so excited. It's this area dress. This is a picture of Emma Leger. I love her. I loved this hairstyle and I kind of want to recreate it. And I found a silver bow that I have from Free People. And then I'm gonna bring these shoes. So I don't always put the hair with it, but I happen to have an idea for the hair for this. So I have my shoes here. And then I have this bow from Free People that I think could work perfectly because it's like a pink sparkly situation. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm so excited. There's literally one fell out, but they give replacements, thank God. So I'll fix that. And it has shoulder pads in it, which I like. But I don't know, it might be too many bows, not sure, but I'm gonna bring it in case. Then I just need to pick out some jewelry. On the jewelry front, I'm trying to think which earrings. I know I'm going silver. I've been wearing so much silver lately, you guys. What's getting into me? I usually like to bring options, because <laughs> that's what I do. But probably maybe one of these, or these circles could be cute. I don't know. I'm gonna bring gonna bring these two options. And then for a little fun fact, these are always, typically always the earrings I wear on the plane. I just always opt for my little gold hoops. I think they're super cute. Or sometimes if I know it's like a silver weekend and I'm only wearing silver jewelry, then I'm like, why wear the gold hoops? And I wear these from Love H. <laughs> so I'll decide tomorrow. Um, once I pick out, I only need one other outfit. Well, like I, my mom and I are going to dinner tomorrow night in Charlotte. So I just need an outfit for that. I need bracelets for this out. I'll bring in case, <laughs> me. But yeah, I only need one other outfit. Tomorrow night, Thursday night, we're going to Angeline's in Charlotte, if you guys are familiar, because I think it's near the hotel we're staying at. And Caitlin, my, one of my best friends, she used to live in Charlotte, so she recommended that, because it's walkable from our hotel, I think, which is always nice, and it's Italian, and she knows. She knows I love Italian. So we're gonna do that, so I'll just bring like a cute casual outfit for that. Friday, um, I'm washing my skim set right now. Brooke and I got matching light pink skims, um, like jumpsuits, sweat sets, whatever. So we wear that while we're getting our makeup done. And, and then I need an airplane outfit. <laughs> this is so low maintenance. Cause normally, like I'm not staying through the weekend, Brooke is, cause her friends are going. So I don't really need much. I'm so chill. <laughs> not really. Okay, Ryan's here. We've got the pizza dough. The pizza dough. And we have absolutely no idea what we're doing. I called my mom's boyfriend, who is a chef, and he was like, the dough needs to rise for like an hour. But I'm like, we bought this. It's not like we made it and it has to rise. Like, maybe it's already risen. <laughs> so I, I said, sure, yeah, but like, we're totally just gonna like make it. So I put some flour on the counter. We washed the counters. And now Ryan's way ahead of me. I'm not really sure. I keep like rolling it and then flattening it again. I feel like I took a pizza class once and we did that. It was my first pizza class. Ryan, show them yours. Very nice. <laughs> oh, you could do a shape of the heart. <gasps> ah! <laughs> I'm not doing that. Yeah, I'm not doing that, but that's perfect. Ah. That flowery.
body count. <laughs> Guys, this is Ryan's. That's mine. Mine got a little burnt because we just didn't get it right at first, but I think these look pretty good. Wednesday night and Pookie just cut up this absolutely fire <laughs> piece. Pookie is looking absolutely wonderful tonight. That's great, baby. <laughs> Were you surprised? I was a little confused. Pookie. Ryan just left and now I'm packing my carry-on bag. I think I'm going with this one. I like it because it has the thick straps. I have to bring two computers. So usually I bring a backpack, but I just don't really feel like wearing a backpack tomorrow. So um, this bag right here is my supplements, like my little travel case, and then um, like my Armour Colostrum minis, Advil, that stuff. We have all different types of lip products. I just like to have options. So we do that. I've been into having this little mini hair clip. It's nice for half up, half downs. My mini Tangle Teaser hairbrush. This is my little tech bag. Tomorrow morning before I leave, I'll put my phone charger and my computer charger in here. And then I also have these wired headphones. Um, and then I also have my AirFly where I can plug it into the TV on the plane and connect it to Bluetooth to my headphones, which is really nice. Um, oh, and then my little adapter because I'm bringing our G7X, our, my G7X to take photos, which are here. Um, so I'll put that with all this stuff. So yeah, I'm bringing my G7X and then my little air stick thing. You can, it's like an Octobuddy. You can put it on something and then put your phone in it. So I've got all kinds of tech stuff there because we have to do behind the scenes stuff. A little lip, some lip liner. I don't go anywhere with this, like honestly anywhere. Like I even take this on nights out. Stress release from Sage Wellness. If, like the plane starts to smell weird, I just put a little bit under my nose or if I'm stressed, everything. I always like to have a snack. Oh, this one's like cracked, so. You guys know I like my Think Bars. Wallet. Breath spray before the meet and greet. <laughs> Hand sanitizer. And then my AirPods, which I'm going to charge right now just to give them a little extra oomph for the night. And then I'll put them in in the morning. Oh, and then I also have this pouch, which just has more like, oh, there's breath spray in here. So we don't need to put that one. Like my Rare Beauty hand lotion, a perfume, just other extra random stuff I might want. I keep in this one here. And then I'll put the computers in the morning and that's what's in my carry-on. Well, it's already almost midnight and I'm not in bed yet, <laughs> but we're gonna get in bed. You guys already know, red lights on, hatch, my 30 minute relaxing sounds, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, coffee's brewing. I'm extra sleepy this morning. Um, but we're going to Pilates. This feels so good. This morning's pre-workout breakfast, one buttered piece of solo bread and then one piece with peanut butter. Cause some of you guys commented that on one of my last vlogs. So I'm gonna try it. It's a little savory, a little sweet. Pilates OOTD, this like ribbed tank top is from the Sculpt Society. Yoga pants are Spanx and then I'm just wearing my Uggs. I'm gonna throw over top this black at the bar sweatshirt and then obviously a puffer on the way out. Using my Pauline bag, bringing my Pilates socks. I like can't, a lot of people do Pilates barefoot or they do it with socks with the grips. If you wear regular socks, like you're just gonna be slipping and sliding everywhere. So that's that on that. Can I bring my headphones? And then I'm actually going to Pilates with Colby, which will be really fun. And then, um, from there, I'm gonna run over to Alteration Specialist. That's where I get like my clothes tailored. And the biggest thing I need to get done when I get things tailored are, are um, hem pants because I'm 5'3 and all pants are long on me and there's a pair of pants I wanna wear for Fashion Week that need to be hemmed. And Fashion Week is next week. So um, that's that. Hopefully gonna get an OPP smoothie somewhere in there. Um, I need to fill up my water bottle. I am sleepy, but it's okay. We're going on a plane today. We're literally flying to Charlotte today. So I'll, well, I never fall asleep on planes, but I'll rest my eyes. 
I am so oddly early in my head. I thought I had to leave my apartment at 8 15. I don't know why because it's a 9 a.m. class. It does not take me 45 minutes to get there. I'm just gonna be early and just sit on the reformer because I need to just go because I can't, you know like when you've packed and all there's left to do is put the toiletry bag in there, like that's what, I, I can't do that right now. So we're just gonna get on with the day, I'm listening to some Drake, which I'm so sad that now I can't use Drake music on TikTok, very sad. Okay, I've looked worse. <laughs> Pilates, got my smoothie, did the tailor, all the things. Um, I am having cottage cheese withdrawals because I didn't get groceries this week, which I'm just gonna still, even if I'm only, whoa, even if I'm only here for two or three days, I just need to get groceries because I just need to. I was craving cottage cheese. I always, after a workout, I want my smoothie and I want a thing of cottage cheese. So I just ran and got two. So I have one when I get back from the airport on Saturday. Low fat one's my favorite tasting. It's just a little bit more liquidy. I really like it. Um, but all they had was the whole milk one. So we'll run with it. Oh my gosh, I'm like salivating at the mouth. So excited. So that's a wrap for this week's video. I love you guys so much. Thank you to Armor Colostrum for sponsoring this video. I'll have a link down below for you guys to check it out. Such an easy thing to add to your routine. I'm about to zip up my suitcase and head to Charlotte. And I can't wait to meet all of you guys there. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.